All right, guys, so you guys have been asking for it, and um, you know I do everything for you guys. Um, we had Jose's shoe collection, totaling about $30,000, 87 Go. pairs of shoes. Right. So he did an amazing job. Well, to be honest, so, I don't have sponsors that send me shoes, so that's why his shoe collection is very high. So you're high. saying you, you, buy, you buy all your shoes? I actually pay for them, and Man. I actually do like shoes, so I buy them myself. Why are you throwing shade? That's fair, that's fair. <laughs> the difference is that A, all my expensive shoes I bought, B, okay, when a sponsor <laughs> sends me something, I have to work for it. It's not just free. Why does he get so, so He gets so, extra. like, I hit a so nerve. So I hit would argue that I'm working for the shoe I paid for it with my time. Are you done? Are you done? That's so fine. is it really free? <laughs> That's fine. But That's the reality fine. is you won't be, you won't be able to So we'll see at Maria's shoe collection. Um, we're going to do the same thing. Counter total price and see how much she has in shoes, how many shoes. And you yeah. said you didn't bring some of your vans, so we're gonna count those in. You just yeah. let me know how many you have. Cause it's like a lot of... It's, it's still a shoe, it's still it's a, a shoe. I have a lot of vans, I just couldn't bring them all. But before we continue, I wanna talk to you guys about Jade Black and this amazing collection, the metal collection is releasing right now at 10 a.m. It's open, so check the link down below so you guys can check out Jade Black. These glasses are, Jose, how amazing these glasses are? They will... <laughs> shatter anything like it's not that they're as good as Ray-Ban they are better than Ray-Ban they are better than Chanel they are better than Yves Saint Laurent because in case you didn't know it's all the same damn brand Luxottica they, they do the same damn thing and they th it's it's an illusion of choice you think you have choices when you go to brands but you don't they use low quality products and since they own all the brands they're keeping the prices high we know the industry and the products and the quality that Ray-Ban and all those brands are using are subpar to what we're using J Black, and we're thing. able to offer it at 49 bucks because unlike them, we're not greedy bastards that are trying to charge you Man, six X. Yeah, but the thing, <laughs> they could probably take us. <laughs> but no, these are pretty damn the impressive. Are back. These um, are the generals. You guys have been asking for those, so we make them better than ever. Glass polarized. Glass. You hear that? That's exactly. polarized. So. Like you said, it's open now. Click the link down below. All right, so let's get started. The all white um, fans, they're a little dirty, but you know, 45. 45? Right? right. Um, I have my high top Converse. These are, these are 45 or two. Yeah, about 50. Yeah, but Bon got these for me for Christmas. These are Alexander Berman. These were 600. Uh, Ultra Boost, I'm gonna say 180. Okay, Reebok Classics. These are like, I think these are 80 bucks. Ooh, one red of, bottoms. One of the worst shoes to possibly ever wear, the Christian Louboutins. They're nice, they're flex, yeah, but I would never wear, I think I've worn these shoes twice and I probably will never buy another pair again. Uh, I bought these in Paris. I'm gonna say like 950. Nike, uh, what are these? Oh, damn, these are old. Nike Air Max Zeros. These are old. I'm gonna say like, I think they were 120. No, these were 130. Okay, um, Vans. These are the slip-ons, the all-white. These are one of my favorite shoes. Go with everything. These were 40, these were 50. Reebok class, uh, these are the vintage. I just got these. Um, the reason I got these are because these are Bad Bunny's favorite sneakers, so I needed them. Um, these were 89, these were 90. Right. Is these are shoe? my CrossFit shoes. When I used to be a CrossFitter a couple years ago. Do you but even I work still, out? Um, I haven't worked out in like two months, but I'm trying to get back. <laughs> uh, these were 80? Okay, these are the Fear of God Nike Air Style. That's a new expedition. Huh? That's a new one you got, right? Yeah, these are literally my, like, I just got these like last week. I, they're not even worn. Bought them for $200. These are my um, Off-Whites, the Air Jordans. The Carolina Blues. These were, I paid 800 for these. I like the two different color. Well, I didn't like that. I did one color and the other white. But you can do whatever you want with it. These are my Vapor Masses off white as well. These were, I think I paid like 650 for these. So, these are my crusty <laughs> uh, white Yeezys. I know I took them to Honduras. I was zip lining and all that with them, so they got a little crusty. But these were, I think they were like 300. Yeah, I paid a little overpriced for them because they usually don't run for that price. All right, these are my 350s, the Sesame's. 
Um, I paid paid 200. I paid retail price for these. Um, move on. These are my Air Max 97s. All red. They're really hard to find. Got them in New York. Right? Yeah, I got these in New York on Flight Club. Um, I paid. I paid 350 for these. Uh, these are the Nike Presto flies. I got these years ago and I thought it was so cool because I got them in all blue. But as you can tell, they're like barely worn. I think I've worn them once, if that. They, they look cool though. Huh? They, they look cool. I mean, they look cool, but Prestos are kind of out. Whatever. I'm pretty sure I paid how much. I paid $100 for these. These are one of my favorite shoes. These are my St. Laurent's. Um, I paid. 850 for these. I just got them recently. 850 for something that looks worn. Yeah, but it, it looks cool as that worn look. Yeah. So I don't mind if they get dirty because they have like, like that off white and like wornish look. 850. These are my top threes. Um, Jose got these for my birthday this past year. These are my favorite shoe of all time. Literally, I think I've worn them tw twice. I mean, they're not really worn. Um, I don't know how much you paid. This. Um, how ballpark it. How much you pay, Jose? I don't remember, bro. Six, seven, hundred? Six or seven, I don't remember exactly. Right. Six, seven hundred. The thing is, I think he paid a lot because I don't think they go for so high because my size is really like. Rare. Uh, these are Gucci. My parents got these for my birthday as well. Just the regular white leather. Gucci shoes, um, they paid $5.50 for these. These are just regular old school black vans, $45. Another pair of vans. Oof, these are crusty. Should I even show these? It's kind of embarrassing, honestly. <laughs> Those are crusty. <laughs> CJ said these are my grass cutting shoes. <laughs> Whatever, it's already in the video. Uh, that's why I got a brand new one. Um, these were $45, but they look like they've been through hell. Um, parents got me this for Christmas. These are Chanel's. I'm not wrong. They put, like, they're really cool. They're espadrilles. I love them. Have you even worn them? Yeah, I've worn them like once or twice. They're not the most comfortable shoe, but they look really cool on. Um, I think they paid like 800 for these. These are uh, old ass shoe. These are my Ultra Boost. When Ultra Boost was the big thing to have the shoe. I think these shoes ran. Some people said that they're still a big thing because Jose said the same thing and they're like, they're still Oh, big I don't know. I just said something. Um, I just feel like, I mean, some people, I, I, it's not that I don't like them, it's just that they're kind of like outdated. How much you pay for them? I think they're like 200. These are my Yeezy Power Phase. I paid 200 for these. Um, these, are, these are my Puma suede. They're really out there, but I like them. I haven't worn these in years. I paid 60 for these. These are my Air Force. The regular ones. I just wasn't sure if they were the mints. Oh yeah, they're just my regular Air Force. Love these shoes the most. To me, they're really comfortable. Um, I paid 90. These are my Stan Smiths. Worn them like once or twice. I'll say 70. Yeah, they're not right. that expensive. Let's put 70 bucks on these. These are my other pair of Air Forces. These are the mints. I paid 95 for these. Love these shoes, a little different, but yeah. They're not as comfortable as the regular Air Forces, but they're nice. 90. Oh, these are one of my favorite shoes. These are the Blazer Mins, the vintage edition. I love these shoes, they look so dope. They look like old school. I love them. Mm -hmm. um, I paid, paid 120 for these. These are my Nike Vapor Maxes, the Fly Knits. I paid 190, round up, let's round up 200 with tax. So yeah, these are my NMDs. So I remember when these first shoes came out, I wanted them so bad because I thought, this was when like Adidas started getting cool. Mm -hmm. I remember this is the shoe that came out. Um, I paid, actually you got these for you and Wendy got these for my birthday. Mm -hmm. But yeah, I really wanted these shoes and I still wear them. I wear them to the gym. These are super comfortable. You don't go to the gym? Well, when I do go to the gym or when I travel, these are like easy like slip on, slip off shoes. They're super comfortable. These are my Air Max 270s. I love these shoes. These were 150. Carla got this, these for me for my birthday. Love these shoes. They're clean. They go with everything. Okay, these are my Continentals. I think I've worn these like once. These are 45 bucks, but they're super clean, so I, I like these. Them. Go literally everything. We all have a pair. Another pair of Vans. These are my Checkered. These were 45 bucks. 
Another pair of bands. These are my pink bands. Oh shoot. Yeah. These are my pink bands. I paid 45. Well, 45. So. How many bands do you have in total? Oh, pff, I didn't bring all of them. I have one, two, three, four, five, six here. I have about, I have about like 10, 12 pair of bands. And they all go for 45. So, so you just still have them. another six at home? Yeah. Oh yeah. These are Nike Air Max, the Thea's. Thea's? Or Thea's, whatever. These are really old, honestly. I paid 95. The last sneaker are the Air Max 97s. Oh. Thomas actually got these for me for my birthday. I love that thing. Yeah, I, I forgot I had these shoes. Um, thanks, yeah, Thomas. Thanks, Thomas. <laughs> uh, these are olive green. I've worn these like once or twice to school. Super comfortable. I love these shoes. Um, he paid 170. No. Nice show. So, next pair of the heels. These are from Zara. I paid 85 for these. These are from. These are professional, but I'm not gonna lie. Uh, they were like 30 bucks, I think. Uh, these are my favorite booties, especially for the winter. Paid. I think I paid 100 for these. I don't remember where I got them, but they're comfy. These are my clear heels. I bought these off of Boohoo. These were like 20 bucks. Uh, these are another pair of Zara's. These are like a caged, like lace ups. These were, I remember these were like 180. Uh, these are my prayer. I have some toy birch, some sandals. Um, you got me these for Christmas, like two Christmases ago. These were toy birch sandals. These go for 180. I have another pair of toy birch sandals. Jose got me this for the same Christmas. That Christmas I got like five pairs of toy birch sandals. Um, these were 180, same ones that Juan got me, Justin Brown. And then that same Christmas, my parents got me Tory Burch sandals. They got me these, these were 100. And then just some regular other Tory Burch sandals. I think I bought these for myself. These were, um, these were 120. I only bought these because every girl in Jupiter High School had them and I wanted to have them. Whatever, so I got them. All right, so that's basically it. And we're and gonna add. Chuck oh, yeah. on my feet. These are from high school. These were $45. <laughs> 45. Alright, so I don't think you beat Jose. How many did you how many shoes are you? There's no way. No, no, there's no way. Yeah, because I mean if anyone wants to sponsor me. <laughs> <laughs> and some shoes. So we have what, like 50 pairs of shoes here? And that, but that's not everything. Because it was just it was impossible for me to bring it was hard. But yeah, it's about fifty pairs. I mean it's still a buttload of shoes. Yeah, I mean, look at all that. But anyways, we're gonna do the counter. We're gonna put it, I'm gonna put it on top. Um, exact number of shoes, exact number or price, and see who won. Um, before, you know, comment down below, who do you think is gonna win before we even finish it up um, till the end of the video. But um, yeah, I think it's, it's gonna be, what's, what's your estimate? Probably like, I'm shooting for 15. 15? I at least wanna get to the double digits, okay? What's your estimate there? 10K. Maybe 10 5K. Okay. Five K, damn. Okay. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm think I'm saying like ten K, which is still a buttload of money. But uh, yeah, so it's interesting, and I'll do one myself as well and see if I can beat the reigning champ I right now. I can't come in last. Well, I think you'll be one. Well, I don't know. I have a lot of shoes, but not eighty-seven pairs of. Shoes. I think I have like more like Maria yeah. pairs of shoes. But um, yeah, I'll see. It. I'll see if I can beat the reigning champ right now. I, I think nobody else can beat him. But like Maria said, he, he, you know, he, he gets sponsored. That's sponsor. not fair. You know what I'm so it's really not. The most expensive sneakers I buy. I think All the expensive shoes in my collection, I've bought. Not me. Really. I've gifted I've you. I saw the video. I've gifted There's a you bunch. Too. The only you gifted me is the top threes. <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this type of video. Uh, you wanted to see her collection, so here you go. Um, let me know what you think. Leave a comment below, and I'll see you guys next time.